morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are. I hope that it is good. And I am so excited about having our guest on today. And um, we'll be talking to him really quick, and his name is Chris, and and uh, he'll be here shortly. So, uh, But before we get to him, uh, there's a few things that we do, and the, one of those things is uh, pull a card for the show, and it's from the Healing with the Angel deck, and it's New Beginnings which we're going into October. So I believe that October, for all of us, is going to be that new beginning, that new start. I can just feel it, something in the air. And so I thought it was very fitting as we go into October, just being the first of October of the new beginning card. So whatever you need a new beginning in your life, just accept that, draw that to you. Also, let's go ahead and open with prayer, and then we'll get to Chris. We're not taking any uh, calls today. Uh, and so, uh, but we're going to get Chris on here uh, shortly, and he'll be talking about what he does and how he got into it, and all of those things, and probably more. All right, so let's go ahead and open with prayer. Father, Mother, God, we just thank you for this day. We thank you for Chris and what he's going to be able to uh, share with us here in this hour's time. And Father, Mother, God, I just pray that you would just bless Chris from the top of his head to the soles of his feet. Continue to use him to help heal. Our, uh, help heal our planet and help heal uh, those on our planet as well. And Father, Mother God, I just thank you for his life. And I thank you for my listeners as always. I ask that you would help them today and that you would meet their needs and, and touch their lives. Uh, touch Rose today. She's not feeling very well today. And so I would just uh, uh, pray that you would just touch her body right now. And she's having some pain in her lower back. And I just ask you to ease this up. Uh, so she uh, will feel that healing virtue from you. And uh, surround all of us with that white light of the Holy Spirit, and we say namaste, and we say amen. Let's go ahead and get Chris on here, because uh, he's um, going to have to uh, be leaving shortly. Uh, I just realized that uh, we only had a 30-minute show schedule, so I'm going to have to add uh, some time. But let's get Chris on here. Hi, Chris. Hey, Michael. Hi. Hi, I just realized I, I'm good. Uh, I just realized I only have 30 minutes with you. I I don't know how that happened, but we'll we'll fix that. <laughs> but but tell we'll us, do what we can. Yeah, we can. Uh, hey, uh, now tell us a little bit about yourself. Well, basically, uh, I'm a quantum energy healer. What what that means is I work with the quantum energy, which is God energy, the universal energy within all of us. And the work that I do, uh, with the way I do it is, is with a pendulum and chart method. So I ask okay. my pendulum, I ask my guides exactly what's going on with a health problem in somebody's specific body. And the pendulum, my guides are going to show me exactly what area of the body and what the problem is. And once I find out what the problem is, be it a virus, a bacteria, a, a parasite, uh, or something spiritual like an entity or a, or a spirit, something demonic, could be something extraterrestrial, whatever it is, um, I find out what area of the body it is, and then I use my sacred geometry, which is a very large pyramid that I've developed, and what I do is I give the pyramid intent. In other words, I tell it what to do, so in other words, I just tell the virus or whatever it is in the body to leave, and through quantum physics, through quantum mechanics, and through the, 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 the will of God, this all happens immediately. Awesome. That sounds cool. Now, how did how did you get into this? I mean, that would be interesting how you got into this. How did yeah, you, how it's, did it's, the... a, it's an interesting story. Um, I've only been doing this uh, uh, professionally for past uh, five years or so, five and a half years. Uh, right. Before that, um, I knew nothing of, of this type of work. I, I could care less if somebody talked to me about spiritual healing or anything alternative. I was in the printing industry for, for 30 years before this, and uh, about eight years ago, my first wife passed away. She had a rare disease called scleroderma. So at that time, at 45 years old, uh, my announcer planner looked at me and says, Chris, why are you working? Look at, look at your portfolio. So I, I took his advice, and I retired. So at, at 45, you know, I still got all my life ahead of me. Um, long story short, when, when you close one door, another door opens. This work I'm doing right now is the work I've meant to be doing all of my life. And I had to close those doors in order for this one to open, and now here I am today. And that's awesome. Because, uh, yeah, because I was watching some of your uh, videos, and, and now you made your own charts too, is that correct? You, you, 
you know, to uh, find yeah, out what, what's what wrong. I did. Yeah, yeah I, uh, I, I, took, I took some courses. I found a course in, uh, out of uh, Ontario, uh, the Radionic and Dowsing Institute of Canada, and they sent me these charts, and I'm looking at these charts, and I couldn't understand them. They were a little cerebral and over, <laughs> over my head in certain ways. Right. So what I did is I just took two other courses that I took, and I combined everything and just made my own charts. That way I understand them. My higher self can understand them. My guides can understand them, and, and there's no gray area. Everything is black and white. Right. And now you know there's you know I know a little bit about energy work. I'm, I'm a Reiki master, but the, now you know for maybe somebody that doesn't understand now there's no boundaries with energy. Energy can work through phones, through Skype, whatever ways, and you do a lot of that, I'm sure, right? Oh, ab absolutely. Um, I, I've, I've got an office in a, a holistic healthcare center in Winnipeg, Manitoba, Canada, where I live. Uh, right. Here's where I sit, you know, five days a week. Uh, uh, 24 hours, almost 24 hours a day sometimes, uh, right. but half of my clientele is in other countries, other cities. So I've got clients in Australia, Norway, yeah. uh, Germany, um, lots in the United States because people are, are looking for a cheaper way of, of health care instead of spending thousands right. of dollars going to, the, to, the, to a, a specialist for $55.00. You can call me, spend an hour with me, and we do a lot of energy work, a lot of clearing, and within that hour, a lot of stuff is done, and within two or three sessions, for most people, their health problem is simply gone. Right. Yeah, because I had, I had, I went in, in uh, July, I went down to Colorado and did some uh, healing work there, and, and, you know, it was amazing, and, and there's, you know, no boundaries. What you also have to do is you have to have a little bit of belief, too, don't you, Chris? I mean, they, you, you have, know that it is yeah, going to work. You have to have a whole yeah. lot of belief. Well, <laughs> you know right. what? Uh, there's, there's a lot of people who, who come in and go, okay, you know what? I don't know about this this alternative stuff. Uh, right. Make me a believer. Uh, and and sh sure enough, now, ultimately, when you stand over one of my tools, I've got many different energy tools that I use, and, and one right. of them is called a neutralization ring. And when you stand over this tool, almost immediately you feel a heaviness within your legs, you, you feel uh, off balance, you feel tingling, and there's no denying that there's energy moving in your body. So I've got your attention that way, okay? Now you're open a little bit. All of a sudden I use my big pyramid and I tell uh, something, uh, something causing pain within your body to go away. All of a sudden that pain is gone, okay? that you've had for, for months and months and months, that pain is gone. How did that happen? Now, for people who are absolutely non-believers, you're not going to be coming in my office or calling me, number one. Number two, if we did work on you, you're going to be saying, well, maybe it just went away on its own. You know, maybe you didn't do anything. But, you know, ultimately, I don't care. As long as your problem goes away, it doesn't matter. Right, yeah. The, the, the main goal is to uh, make somebody feel better. And so it doesn't well, matter... It doesn't matter how that happens. It's you know it just happens, and you know yeah. now I saw I saw a picture of your pyramid. Now how did that come about? How did you how did you start? I mean, was that a lot influenced by your guide, or how did that come about? Well, I've, I've got a tool maker in Alberta, Canada, and and this guy, without a word of a lie or exaggeration, is the strongest energy person on the planet, in in my opinion. His right. job on a daily basis is to go into the earth grid and clear all negative energy out of the earth grid so the earth can go into fifth dimension ascension. What he does on the side to make money is he makes these tools. So what he developed was a pyramid, seven-inch yeah. pyramid, and then he, he put two other pyramids on top of it to make a triple. When you look at the base of the pyramid, you see the Star of David. That's the sacred geometry as long as the pyramid. And what I did with it is I added two more pyramids, soldered them together, added a bunch of quartz crystals, magnets, sacred, other sacred geometry, magnifying glasses. I put some shungite in there, and it just intensifies the energy so much that it, it goes over the wavelengths, and it gets right in deep into the cells and into the photons of somebody's body and makes the quantum changes. Awesome. That's cool. cool. Now, was there anybody in your family uh, that does healing, or you're the only one? I, I'm, I'm, I'm the black sheep. <laughs> Well, we, I, we, I come from we don't want to call yeah. you the we don't want to call you the black sheep. You're just different, I guess, for the rest of them. Yeah, I'm, I'm different, all right. Um, I come from a, an old strict Mennonite background. Uh, my parents both lived, uh, you know, in families of twelve kids, and right. and uh, come from an old old country uh, philosophy of things. And a lot of my 
relatives back home think that I am the devil because of the work I do. Right. So yeah, I'm the only person in my family doing this. Yeah, and and now do you, do you have problems with your family because of that, or they just? Uh, there's some distance. I, I would say I just went to a funeral right. last week, and of course they they're going to say hi to you and everything, but they're not going to spend a lot of time or invite right. you into their home or or you know talk about the work right. you do. Yeah, because they probably, you know, and and I think the one thing that that is going on on our planet, Chris, is a lot of people are opening up more and more to this, and and are seeking out different terms because they're realizing, you know, medicine has its place, and we're not against medicine because we believe, you know, in that. But but a lot of people are looking for alternatives. They're looking for something else. Uh, would you agree with that? Oh yeah, absolutely, and. You know, there are so many alternatives out there. People are, are like, well, what do I do? You know, there's, there's homeopathy, there's natural path, there's Reiki, there's quantum touch, there's EFT, there's elemental P. You name it, there, there is something out there. So what I'm trying to do uh, through, through radio, wonderful radio shows just like yours, Michael, is to, to right. spread the word, okay? Uh, people need education. People yes. need to know that this exists so, so right. that they can make that conscious decision on, on what type of, of healing modality would work best for them. Yeah, and, and to find out what works because, you know, what you do with your healing might not work for that particular person, you know. It, it's sort of like medicine, you know. Not all medicine works the same way with everybody else. So Yeah, so for, a lot, for a lot of people, yeah. Yeah, go ahead, For Chris. a lot of people, there's, there's so many different types of modalities and, and, you know, ultimately it's what resonates with you. If you look at my right. videos compared to somebody else's videos, you might say, I like that other guy better. And then you go to him that works, and that's all that matters. Right. Yeah, that's all that matters. Yeah. And I, I would recommend people to uh, go to YouTube and, and type in your name and, and look at the videos. You know, we're not going to have a lot of time to deal with a lot of the stuff that that, that you deal with, but uh, we'll have you back. But, you know, there's a, there's a lot of things. And you mentioned, you know, um, you know, like, you know, you could be influenced by other spirits, uh, by aliens, or, you know, by other forces. Now, now, how would that, you know, what do you mean when you talk about that? I mean, what kind of uh, um, energy? Basic, basically, with, with spirits, um, on a daily basis, everybody, 99.9% .9 of us have got some kind of spirit attachment within us. And quite right. often, this spirit attachment can lead to a health problem or can be a contributor to a health problem. So uh, let, let's take, for instance, somebody has had a miscarriage, unfortunately. So if, if that spirit of, of the fetus is still within uh, the, the mother's uh, uterus, that is going to cause a health problem, okay? And I work with this weekly with, with people uh, wanting uh, to work on fertility. If there's been a miscarriage involved or an abortion or something like that, you have to move out the spirit which is involved. Also, there's people who, let's say, lost a loved one, and that loved one does not want to go. So they're going to attach to their favorite person in the family and they're right. going to hold on and not, not go into the light. And that creates uh, 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 disruption within the body, disharmony, and, and then it creates a health problem. It's a contributor. Right. Okay. That makes, a, that makes a whole lot of sense. Now, the question that I have for you, and maybe you haven't thought about this, and not, hopefully I don't put you on the spot, but I have, a, I have a question for you. Now, a lot of times, you know, I believe in past lives. Now, can this help with, like, maybe something in a past life affecting us? Would that work with this? A absolutely. If, if, you know, within my charts, I've got every, uh, every type of problem imaginable. And if something is following you from a past life, I can use my pendulum to find out what past life it is, and I can go work with you in that past life to clear out that problem, and it'll it'll help the healing in this lifetime. So yes, yeah, past lives, past dimensions, whatever it is, it doesn't matter. When you're working with energy and spiritualism, anything is possible. Okay, awesome. Yeah, and then one thing I will tell you, Chris, I love your energy. I can just feel your energy, and it, you know, I'm like, uh, it's vibrating around me, so I can just feel that. Uh, but <laughs> But, but and that's one thing. When I was watching your videos, I, I was like, I, I like this guy. He's awesome. So, uh, but you know, now, now, can you do like something with us? Like, how can we, you know, fill some of the energy that you do, or uh, while we have you on here with us? Uh, uh, and and to what? Oh, okay. Okay. I'm gonna grab one of my tools. Hold on a second. Can you hear okay. me? Okay. 
Yeah, I can hear you. Okay, great. Uh, hold on one second. Okay. So what I've got here is one of my neutralization rings. This is this is a ring that I sell on my website. Uh, this is a larger version, though. And uh, what this is going to do, now what people can do who are listening is if you stand up and if you've got your hands on, on your computer or your phone, whatever you're listening to the show on, um, within about so, you know, 30 seconds or a minute, what you may feel is a heaviness within your legs, like your, your legs are trying to be pulled into the ground. You might feel off balance, like something's pushing you, or you might feel tingling or something. So we're going to give this a, a good minute or so. And, and, Michael, you can do the same thing if you want to stand up Okay. And, and just let me know when you feel something happening. Not, not everybody's going to feel this, but every time I do a radio show, we do this, and, and we get quite the result. Okay. So it's going to take you know a good 30 seconds or a minute. Let me know when you feel something happening. And, and you'll notice it. It'll be like, wow, what is that? Okay. All right, I'm feeling something, yeah. I mean, it's hard it's for me really to tell good. because I, I have a lot of energy anyhow, so it's, it's a little... Right, and this, this is a new energy for you. These tools is not a lot of people that have them. Um, you just can't go look on the Internet and find these things. You've you got to hunt for them. But the guy who makes them does not advertise them. He relies on people like me to move for them. Uh, so there's not a lot of people who know this type of energy, this sacred geometry. So if you're feeling a heaviness in your legs, what this is doing is pulling negative energy out of your chakra system out of your physical body and out of your aura. And I always do this to start off a session, just, just to do a general clearing to, to get into the body. Yeah, because it feels like the one thing that's happening with me, Chris, is the one thing I feel is like somebody like pulling on my feet. I mean, yeah, it, it, yeah, it, yeah it, it definitely feeling something going on. <laughs> okay, so, so we're going to put that one down. Okay, so, so everybody's had a chance to feel that. Now, if you want to uh, get more of an impression on these tools, if you go on my YouTube site, it's, it's C-H-R-I-S. K-E-H-L-E-R, YouTube, and look up my name, Chris Kaler. I've got about 60 videos that explain my philosophies. It shows off the tools, and I also do uh, some demonstrations with the tools that run the energy through the server of YouTube, and you can actually feel them. So I'm going to put that one down. Now, we're going to take my big pyramid. Okay, this is called the Silver Light Pyramid. And what I'm going to do with this, I'm going to give it some intent. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to run God's light and God's love through the entire server into each and every listener's computer. And if you have any kind of health problem or pain or something, this might do an instant healing, okay? We're basically doing like Jesus used to do in the day and run this energy through a person's body with light photons. Okay, here we go. <clears throat> now this you're going to feel in, in a form of a tingle, Maybe a prickle. <sighs> there we go. Ooh, that felt good. <laughs> yeah, that's nice. I'm, wear I'm wearing my headset, so I had to do it on onto my head. <laughs> and I just gave myself <laughs> a <bubble> blast. <laughs> so, so that's you know, if you felt that, great. You know, uh, if you didn't, and you want to experience this. Check out my website, and anybody can get a hold of me anytime they want. I'm very easy to get a hold of. My website is chriskaler.net. Not .com, that's somebody else, that's another Chris Kaler. But if you right. go under chriskaler.net, there I am. I'm very easy to get a hold of, and I can do a demonstration of the tools for you uh, anytime. So uh, look me up. I appreciate that. Yeah, and 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 the and the one thing, Chris, there, there is. I have a question, and I know that we're running down. We we did extend for the whole hour, but the, 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 there there was a question that I have, and maybe you can help me with it really quick. Uh, years ago, I, about 2006, I, I had blood clots in my lungs. The doctors had no idea where they came from. There was no other no other place where where there was clotting in my legs or anything like that. And after and after that, went to a blood specialist, and there was there was no there was no um, my blood is inaccessible to clotting, so we have no idea how how those appeared in my lungs. But they they kept. Let's see if we can find out quickly. Let's see if we can okay. find out quickly what caused okay. Michael's blood clotting. What's the cause of Michael's blood clotting? So I've got my pendulum. I'm asking my guides 
Now, my guides are, are really specific. Uh, one of my main guides is, uh, his name is Kareil. And when he was on Earth, he was in the Pharaoh Khufu. Okay, so he's got his own dimension that I work with and with him. And when I was, when he was here, I was here also with him, and I was his son, Sofu. So I've got a special connection with him. I also work uh, directly with Jesus Christ. I also work with God. I work with the universe. And I work with something called they, V-A-I-G-H. And what they is, is the energy before the universe was here. So I work with a lot of different energies. I also work with Nostradamus. I work with Edgar Casey. I work with Samuel Hahnemann, who's the father of homeopathy. So basically what I'm picking up here is that he had a mineral deficiency. Okay. Okay. I also work with nutrition. So, so I go deep into finding out what minerals uh, a person can be deficient in or excess in. A lot of people don't realize if you're excess in, let's say, calcium or iron, that can cause huge, huge health problems. What mineral was Michael deficient in causing blood clots? Okay, so this is showing me that, that you were probably deficient in copper, which meant that your, your blood cells wouldn't absorb iron, okay? So that iron has to go somewhere. It's called iron storage disease. So that can go anywhere, you know, from your liver to your kidneys to your brain to your muscles. And in, in this case, uh, the, the iron was trying to absorb into your red blood cells, but it wouldn't absorb in, so it just kind of formed around them and caused, made a clot. So that's basically what, what's showing up here. We'd have to go and spend a good half hour, 45 minutes right. to, to go deep into it to find out exactly. But that's kind of the, the, the feeling I'm getting right now is that you're uh, deficient in copper. Okay, yeah, and, and I sort of felt that too. So that 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 sort of uh, confirms what my own intuition was <laughs> sort of picking up. So okay. that, that, is, that is pretty awesome. And, and, you know, and we go back, you know, before I let you go, the one thing that I want to go back to, you know, your family – you know, you were talking about re-educating people and educating people in this. And, you know, the one thing I've learned, uh, Chris, while I do the work I do, you know, a lot of times what we don't understand, we fear. And, you know, and I think that a lot of people just don't understand alternative medicine. They don't understand how it works. And so immediately they go into that place of doubt, that place of fear. Would you agree with that? Yeah, 100%. And, again, like, like I said, uh, this is why... I'm doing all the YouTube videos. This is why I'm doing all these radio shows. It's just to educate people because people know this is out there. And, and a lot of people are kind of leaning towards it, but they're still unsure. So, so we need to create a comfort level that everybody can feel the energy. That's why I have the tools on my website. That's why I have the tools on my YouTube channel. So everybody can feel this and they can know, they can have a comfort level with it. Right. Because you gotta, you gotta be, you gotta be comfortable. And the, you know, and the one thing that, that, that I've, I've found interesting about, you know, I watched your uh, one of, I think it's the first YouTube video that you have on your YouTube videos, and you know, I, I was sitting there because I, you know, when people contact me to be a guest or I contact people to be a guest, you know, I go check them out and. You know, and and I was sitting there and I was asking my spirit guide about this because, you know, this was new to me in some of this. You know, I know what a pendulum is and I've used that in my own, you know, in my own work. Mm -hmm. But, but you know, I was just sitting there thinking, okay, is this, you know, what is this pyramid thing? You know, what is this all about? And, and I, I you know, and, and my spirit guide just, all he did, he didn't say anything. He just smiled. And, uh -huh. and, I, and I thought, okay, what that meant to me was, Hey, you know, you'll find out. And and you know, and when we were doing the, you know, the one thing that we did, you know, with the healing, I definitely felt uh, different energy. Like I said, I have a lot of energy, so it's really hard for me sometimes to, you know, tap into that. But I did feel a difference. And and earlier, uh, the one thing that I also will say is before the show started, I wasn't feeling good, and now I don't feel that anymore. Now, you know, is that because of what we did? You know, I don't know. But yeah, we we, we did we did a we did a small <laughs> healing for sure. Yeah, yeah. Now, because you know, I felt you know I was feeling something while we were talking, something breaking up. You know, I could feel that inside of me because, again, you know, I'm 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 more aware of what's going on in my body than a lot of people. So I did feel something happening there. So I just thought I'd let you know that, you know, that something was breaking loose. So that's a good thing because I was like. An hour before the show, I started not feeling good, and and I thought, okay, this is not good. 
I thought, okay, I got, I, but but I thought it was perfect. I thought, okay, hey, I got a, I got a, I got a Hillary kind of guy coming on my show. So hey, we'll just we'll just yeah, see what happens. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so now now uh, uh, I did have a question, and it just I mean it just went out of my head. I just had a question, but now now how do we how do we get hold of you know some of the tools that you use? We, we can find all that information on your website or. Yeah, very easily. Just go on my website, have a look at, at what I've got to, to offer. There's different types of rings. There's pyramids of different forms. There's beamers, which are like energy wands that contain noble gases. And there's shungite. There's all different types of things. You can have a look at whatever's there. If you're unsure what it is, send me an email, give me a call, and, and I'll use my pendulum to tell you exactly what you need at what time of, of your development. And I'm not going to try and sell you everything because, you know, I have morals and, and I, I, what I don't do is I'm not a charlatan. I'm not going to take you for every dime you have. So I will just sell you what you absolutely need for that point in time in your development and show you how to use it. Once you buy something, you're part of my club. And, and if you have a question, you email me and I will answer it. I will help you through tough times. I will, I will walk you through the whole process. So have a look at all the items, and those are only about half the items that, that I carry. I carry a lot more different things, and, and I can definitely uh, guide you to to what you need. Yeah, because I'm over. I'm actually while you're talking, I'm actually over on your project at the moment. Now I have a I have a question for you, Chris, uh, really quick, sure. because I I'm not familiar with what shungite water stones are. What are those, and how oh, how do they help? Shungite. Us? Oh, shungite. You got to do some research on shungite, man. Uh, <laughs> okay. This, this is an amazing healing stone. Everybody knows about quartz crystals and, right. and amethyst and all these different healing types of stones. Shungite was discovered maybe 10, 15 years, something like that ago. Uh, there's only one place that it can be uh, found, and that's a, a certain town in Russia. Okay, it, it's a black stone. And it's got the composite of carbon, so it's absorbent, okay? If you were to look at the molecule of it, it would look like a soccer ball with the panels on it and everything. It's very absorbent. So what shungite is good for is absorbing EMF and ELF radiation. It's good for absorbing negative energies. Now, what shungite also does, if you take this, the water stones, you put them in a, a gallon of water, it's going to remove all of the impurities out of the water, and it's also going to add all the 98 different minerals your body needs into the water. It's also going to add a specific type of healing energy into the water. So if, if you're energetic, if you take a crystal wand or any kind of uh, crystal tool, hold it to the shungite water, and you give it intent, you tell it to do something, when you drink that water, it's going to go in and do it. Shungite is very powerful. It, it's got a lot of properties. It's something that everybody should definitely be looking at if you're into energy work. Okay. Yeah, I'll have to check it out, and maybe we can uh, talk about that some other time on uh, while we have you on air. But, but because I, I was just, I, 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 it's at the top of your project list here, and I w and I was stuck on it, so there might be a reason, and so I might be uh, buying some of it from you to see what's going on with it because sure. I was actually drawn to it. Uh, but there's, a, you know, I, I I love your sun ring. I mean, it looks like the sun. I mean, so I mean, there's just all kinds of amazing things on there. And uh, so um, I might be talking to you about some of this stuff, but uh, but you know I I appreciate you being on. I I know that you're going to have to be going here soon, but we'll have you back on uh, where we can be more um, relaxed and and uh, talk more about what you do do. But now now if somebody wants to get hold of you, how do we get hold of you besides your website? You said you have an office in. Um, yes, my my telephone number in in Winnipeg, Canada is two zero four. Two five five zero nine three nine. The name of my clinic is the Cass Sky Holistic Healthcare Center. Ask for me, ask for Chris, and they will put you through, no problem. Um, my email address is C K E H L E R one zero zero at S H A W dot C A. I'm very easy to get a hold of. Just Google my name, and, and you're going to see two pages of my name on there. Okay. Right, yeah, because that's how, you know, that's how uh, I found you, or and you know, just yeah, there's amazing stuff. Um, but Chris, I appreciate you being here, and uh, you know, um, you know, I, I'm just amazed uh, by you know what we did on the show, and that was just a few minutes, okay, you know, uh, of, <laughs> of, of 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 work there. So, uh, you know, I would recommend you to everybody, and just say, hey, you know. 
contact them and you know not everything works for everybody you know that's one thing we have to realize it's like when, when i tell people on the show you know you know if i don't resonate with you move on to somebody else you know and that's probably that's what you you know that's the same thing you would tell them you know if you don't resonate you know a lot of times you know it's just like a doctor you know you go into a doctor's office i've done this many times i've gone into a doctor's office you know i sit down with them i just don't resonate you know my you know i just, 90% yeah, 90% of the people i work with get results yeah and that and that's 90%. the thing yeah, and that that's awesome. <laughs> that's a that's a good percentage, and so you know, and and you know, because like I said, you know, I I was having I don't know what was going on with me, and it, I can just say it's gone. So that's that's amazing, uh, and that was just awesome. in a few that was a few seconds, and we, you know, we thank Spirit for helping us with that. But well, Chris, Wonderful. you have a good night, and uh, you know, we'll have you back here. Uh, sometime soon, um, maybe um, maybe this month, later on in the month, we'll look at your calendar and see where you are. Uh, but we'll get you back on here and we can talk about how, you know, the one thing that I would be interested, Chris, is, is you know, a lot of people are affected by negative energy. And so, you know, maybe we can have focus more on how, you know, attachments do affect us and, and, you know, how can we get rid of those and things like that. And that oh, would be, wonderful. Yeah, that would be a whole nother <laughs> time. Slot. That would be a good show. That would be a good show. Yeah. yeah, and so maybe we'll do that later on in the month, and you can look at your calendar, and I'll send you an email, and we can get together with that and see see where you are on you your tell calendar. Tell me when you want me. I'll be there for you, Michael. Okay. Uh, maybe towards the end of October because Halloween's coming up, so maybe you know around that time. Uh, so, all right, Chris, you, ha- you have a great day, and we'll, we'll have you back here later on in October. All right. Thank you, Chris. Thank you so much, Michael. Take care. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Yeah, and and that would be an awesome show because you know how how do you know how does energy affect us and how how can we uh, work with that? So you know we'll have them back here. Uh, I'll be sending them a date as soon as we uh, get done with this show. <laughs> and so, but he had to go because he had a um, a, um, a client that he was going to uh, be seeing. But you know, check out his website. I mean, there's some really awesome things over there. I'm over on his website right now. It is www chriskeller.net that is c-h-r-i-s k-e-h l-e-r dot net and you know I am I think I'm going to contact them and get uh, some of the Shungite water stones and see how they work uh, you know there there's just so amazing things over here oh, on, the, on the services he offers let's click over there uh, you know he, ha- he has distant healing at the top so you know you know, the one thing that I like about energy, there is no distance in energy. You know, there's no distance. And, you know, even with the archive listeners, you know, that energy that he put into the show is in the show. I don't know if you guys felt anything that was, when that was going on, but I definitely felt something. And I definitely keep I keep feeling it. You know, again, it, it's, it's hard for me to distinguish because I have so much energy. But I can tell you that before the show started, because I almost contacted Chris an hour before the show, I was not feeling good. Something was in my stomach and was affecting me. And when we did the, when Chris did the healing thing, there was definitely something breaking up in my stomach. I could feel it moving around in there. And so, you know, and I would be interested if something happened with you. You know, something happened with you when, when uh, and I'm sure that Chris would love this too. So if something happened today with you during the show, please email me at youareawakening at gmail.com and let us know. If you felt something when Chris did that, you know, let us know. I'm sure that he would like to know that, and I definitely would like to know that. So, uh, you know, send that to us. I, I would appreciate it. You know, we'll have Chris back here. I knew that we just were not going to have the time with him uh, today, and maybe we'll have a longer show where he could actually do maybe some sample readings and stuff like that and, you know, look more into, uh, you know, the, the mineral deficiency thing and that's going on with me. And, you know, those are just, you know, some amazing things that happened today. And, and um, you know, check out his YouTube videos. Again, his website, www.chriskiller.net.